Takashi is now on the move once more after his house address. It was released for the second time within a week. Now for his now infamous IG Live, which clocked in 2 million followers, well there he was housed up at a house at Lido Beach. It's valued at a whopping $1 million. Now he found the listing online, which included an in-ground heated pool. He also had access to a private beach, but it didn't take long for a neighbor to spot him out on the balcony. So the man had to move. So I'm in my fucking room. 6ix9ine is literally, he moved into the house behind me. He's taking pictures on the back deck. Now it's believed that this house is the location that the Gooba music video was filmed at. Now it did look like social distancing to me, but hey, I ain't gonna snitch. Side note, there was also a Jason Derulo and Nicki Minaj music video that used the exact same rainbow colored box. I guess that box is like deliverable on wheels and then anyone can just rent it and film a video in it. I actually wouldn't mind renting that for myself. Now once the girl docks Takashi out on the balcony, well the address of 10 Royal Street in Lido Beach, it went public. And from there, well fans, they started showing up at the house. Now the police, they were the next to arrive on the scene and they had to relocate 6 9 Knock knock, 6 9 baby. Now wait till you see the house he pulled up at next. This thing's worth a whopping $4.7 million. It's beautiful. And this unique property located at 24 Deer Run in Watermill has it all. Surrounded by expansive farmland and distant views of the ocean, you'll be surprised when you see this one of a kind interior design. All right, so we got a full breakdown on the new house that he moved into. Also some details on his new whips. The kids live in large. What's going on guys, it's your boy Michael McCrudden with a new episode of Famous News. Now we got a few new announcements here on this channel. I just got the Instagram handle for Before They Are Famous. It took like a year to get, it also cost me a few bucks. So be sure to go over there and give us a follow. Also I've set up a merch shop where you can buy some Before They Are Famous gear. It's at michaelmccrudden.com or beforetheyarefamous.com so you can support the fame gang. All right, now let's get into this video. Hello. I'm in the hospital. You lie so much to send me. location. Number one. Lance Lazaro, the rapper's attorney, he confirmed to TMZ that Daniel Hernandez had been moved to a new location due to the address leak. He also stated that the government, they were made aware of the relocation. Now the government doesn't need to be made aware. All they gotta do is follow DJ Academics or me on Famous News. Now the first house in Lido Beach, well it was a modest one in a quiet neighborhood out in Long Island. Now according to real estate sources, well the home it would have cost over $4,000 to rent per month and the market value, it was just around $1 million. Now 6 Nights house, it was a single family home spanning 1,878 square feet of space and it was situated on 6,500 square foot. The house itself, it was built in 1971 and it's been renovated plenty of times since. Now there are four bedrooms and 3.5 baths according to the listing. Don't know what he needs all those bedrooms for. I bet he's just got one bed and two babes if, you're, if you were to ask me. There's also a spacious kitchen in this part of the house as well. There's a lot of natural light and bright white walls and it also gives the house this like beach house vibe. Not to mention there's also floor to glass ceiling doors that lead out to the patio in the backyard where he shouldn't have went because that's how he got doxxed. There's also an additional den and family room and the floors in this house, they're a mixture of hardwood and tile if you needed to know. Now there was room to park one or two cars in the garage and then he had additional space out on the driveway. And knowing now that 6 9 had so many whips, well, it looks like he needed more space. Now from here, he moved to 24 Deer Run Water Mill in New York. It was out in the Hamptons. There's some short video clips they've surfaced of the mansion and the cars on his driveway, which has led a lot of people to believe that this is exactly where 6 9 has moved now. Good. This ain't no situation, bro. Larry, look at that. Look at that. Jeez. Copy. Copy. 6 9 who? Dude, there's some guy in that red car. Alright, let's get out. <laughs> what? What? Are you fucking kidding me? Let's go. Yes, sir. Six nine. 
got a fucking Rex. Hello. Hello. There. That's that crib. And that. here before they are famous we love to do our digging and we were actually able to find a full house tour online of this mansion and this thing it's an absolute beauty now according to the listing well this place it would have cost him sixty thousand dollars per month in rent and it's valued at over 4.7 million dollars now the lot it sits on over an acre of land and inside the home it spans over 8,000 square feet of living space it was custom built in 2005 and the home is described as an entertainer's paradise wait till you hear about the stuff they have from al capone now there are seven beds and eight baths with five fireplaces spread over three stories and every inch of the house it's been designed with perfect detail and craftsmanship and it combines modern upgrades with old world charm. Those are not my words, but it's a nice house. Also, it's got cathedral ceilings, wood flooring, and even ocean views. Now the main floor, it offers the sun-drenched great room with double height, vaulted ceilings, and the formal dining room with space for over a dozen guests. There's also a den, a powder room, and then an eat-in kitchen with multiple countertops and state-of-the-art appliances. Now the master suite where all the magic happens, well, it's on the main floor as well, and it's got its own fireplace, a large attached bath, a walk-in closet, as well as walk-out French doors opening up to the pool. Now moving on to the second story of the house, well, each of the spacious bedrooms, they have their own ensuite bathroom as well. Now the walkout lower level of this place, it looks like the coolest area of the mansion as well. It's made with reclaimed barbed wood and exposed brick. I love that, that's like my look. Now here there's a cozy gathering room or a den. It's also got a full private bar, a cigar bar, a wine cellar, billiards room. It's got a home movie theater. It's got half bathroom with an ensuite guest bedroom. And if that's not enough, well there's also a sauna with a separate shower and change room. And get this, they even have seating from Al Capone's old Chicago house. Nice touch. Now finally, outside the house, it's equally impressive. Now the property, it overlooks an equestrian farm and even faraway ocean views. And the whole lot, well, it's fitted with lush landscaping. Now features on the grounds, they include a heated 60 foot freeform pool. There's also a spa with a waterfall. There is bluestone patio, a tennis court. There's also a basketball court, an outdoor shower and a barbecue grill. You know 6 9 gonna get himself one of them rainbow kiss the chef. Now also offered on this property is a separate apartment and of course the fancy home, it is fully gated as well. Yeah, there's a security team that will keep him safe because fans already know where this house is so surely they're gonna be showing up. I'm happy to see that this place is gated. I think this is where he's gonna be locked down. He also can fit all his whips. On his driveway we've seen a McLaren, a Rolls Royce, a G-Wagon, a Range Rover and at least one Lambo. Now with all this 6 9 news blowing up the world over, we'll look forward to a new The Rich Life video we're going to get working for you guys probably after this one, but expect it sometime next week. My name is Mike McCrudden. If you're new to the channel, be sure to subscribe. Be sure to follow us on our new Instagram at Before They Are Famous. Check out the merch. I appreciate all the support. I'll see you guys in another video. Also, 6 9 if you're watching this video, get back to my DMs. All right. I know he watches. Okay, bye.